What's up everybody, this is Danny, and today we're gonna unbox a secret package from OnePlus. It's gonna be epic. Let's get into this. So think of this as the ultimate OnePlus 5 unboxing. Oh. Mm, got some cool accessories here too. We'll take a look at all that later, but what's important is what's in this box right here. All right, so let's get into this. So this is a little bit of a special package because what I have here is the brand new soft gold OnePlus 5. But we're not gonna stop there because what we're gonna do is we're gonna unbox every single color here. I have all three. Get that little blade out and let's go ahead and cut into this plastic real quick. Let's go ahead and start with the brand new one first. They just announced this today, so if you wanna pick one up, I'll leave a link down below for you. And there is the soft gold right there. And both of these have black fronts on them, so this is the first one plus five with the white front. I actually think that looks really nice. And wow, look at that gold color. This is beautiful. This is the same as the soft gold that came out with the three and three T. It looks really, really nice. And then let's go ahead and pull off this one. And this one is, oop, if I can get it out of there. This one is the Slate Gray. And I've actually never seen this one in person either. Uh, I've always owned the Midnight Black one. So wow, that is also really nice. Wow, I like that color. I might actually prefer this over the black. And then let's go ahead and pull off this one. There we go. And now we're looking at Midnight Black. I'm sure you've seen plenty of OnePlus 5 unboxings, but hopefully this is the most epic one that you've seen. And if you haven't seen a OnePlus 5 being unboxed before, then here we go. I'm going to only unbox one of these because the same stuff comes in all of them. You have this cool little picture here, and then you have a personal note from Carl Pei, co-founder of OnePlus. You get dash charger, and you get USB Type-C cord. So you don't get a whole lot in the box here, but dash charging is definitely a go. And if you wanna know what is in here, you get a quick start guide, SIM removal tool, oops, and you can't forget about the OnePlus stickers. Here are all three of them right here. Let's take a look at the one that is brand new. This is the soft gold. Let's take the plastic off of the back. We'll take this sticker off too. And there it is. This is a very subtle gold, a different gold than you're usually used to. I'm actually not a huge fan of gold, but this looks really, really nice. And I am digging that front white color too. It actually gives the OnePlus 5 a different look and I like it. We'll take a look at the slate gray now. I really like this color. It's like a gunmetal color. I'm digging this for sure. I'm used to seeing the midnight black, which I've been using now since launch, but this is a really nice color as well. Let's go ahead and flip these two over so you guys can see side by side here. Okay, and then the last one we'll take a look at is the Midnight Black. Take that off, take this off too. And there it is. So people that love the matte black, you're gonna really like this color as well. But actually these two look kind of similar on camera, but this one is probably like two or three shades lighter, if you can see. So let me know which one is your favorite out of these three. We can even make it a little crazier and bring a fourth one in. And this is my dbrand dragon skin version. And that looks amazing as well. So we can actually say four. So if you want to pick up a dbrand skin, I'll leave a link in the description for you. And this has been my daily driver since. I love this dragon skin. Looks so good on the OnePlus 5. So if you're not familiar with the OnePlus 5, I did a full review on this phone, and I also did a dedicated review on the dual camera system on the back. So I'm gonna leave both of those linked down below if you're interested. My thoughts haven't changed too much since the original review, so I can still stand behind it. I think it's still one of the best phones that you can buy for under $500 right now. So when it comes to cost per performance ratio, I still think this is one of the best. It hasn't been perfect though. There's definitely been software bugs along the way, but I have to give them props for pushing out a ton of software updates. I think since I've owned this phone, I've had like five to six software updates since then. They've improved the camera quite a bit since then, and they also finally added stabilization to 4K video recording. 
So if you're thinking about buying a OnePlus 5, but you're waiting on that soft gold model, go for it. It looks beautiful in person. So that's available now. And let me know which color is your favorite out of all of these that you see here. And I probably don't need all of these phones. So I might be giving one away. Let's just say that if this video hits a thousand likes, we're gonna give one of these away. So let me know what you guys think of the soft gold OnePlus 5. Is this the color that you were expecting or waiting for? Or do you want them to come out with some other colors, red, blue? Let OnePlus know in the comment section below. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you wanna see more cool videos like this. Hit that bell icon so you don't miss any videos like this. Also, follow me on social media. Slap that like button so we can give one of these away. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.